Magnet Fishing Madness. We're going to go ahead to another park lake, supposedly private. So this is going to be fun. I think we're going to get tons of fishing lures. Uh, this is a place that I used to fish all the time with a bunch of my buddies. Speaking of buddies, I'm picking up my friend Joel right now. And he's going to be fishing with the magnet that I caught in the other video. If you didn't see that, uh, you better check it out. Like, how do you catch another magnet magnet fishing? I don't know, but I did it. It's just, yeah, check it out. I'll link it up here. Anyways, we're going fishing. See you there. See it from here. This is Joel. Say hi, everybody. Joel, say hi to everybody. I told you he was shy. But anyways, we're gonna get some good stuff today. I'm excited. I know this place like the back of my hand, and I gotta watch my step right now. Or I'm gonna fall. You know what it means when you pull up your sleeves. It is time to get to work. Okay, Joel, here we go. This one in the crazy box. This crazy box that I made. I'll explain how I made that in a different video. Uh, this is Joel's magnet for the day. This is the one that we caught and we cleaned up last time. So I put a new rope on it, obviously. It was pretty ugly. But here you go. You ready to do this? He's never ma magnet fished before, so he's a little intimidated. But it's very easy. Very easy indeed. Isn't that right, folks? This is super simple stuff. Just cast and retrieve. And get what you get. Just don't get stuck. There you go. So you can put your... There. Like that. And then you can put your gloves on. That's it. Oh, yeah. Like I said, I think Joel's going to catch more than me. Because, uh, you know, that's how it always goes whenever you go with someone else. When you bring them, they always show you up or show off or whatever. Told you, magnets have power. First cast of the day here. First set of knots. Wow, look at the difference in color in the line. Wet, not wet. Ooh, and I feel a craggy bottom. Nothing on the first cast. That's good though, because if you believe in superstition, it's bad to get something on the first cast. What you get? Nothing. Nothing yet. That's what's up. Good shot. What do we get? Nothing. I'm gonna step on this line here. There's a better throw. Sorry, I just whipped you guys. Pick up the slack. I know people have lost rods in here before. Oh, what'd you get? Nice. Check it out. Wow. Up That's a gnarly nail. Good job. In that piece. Cool. The leaf is magnetic. Piece. It's a magnet leaf. Oh, you got a little split shot or something on there. Yeah, definitely. Cool. Oh boy, I gotta go get the trash can. We'll clean it up. Oh, I think I got something that's pretty heavy. Of course not. I'm just feeling things. There we go. Huck it out there. Chuck it out there. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. 
There we go. Man, it feels crazy down there. Bet you we got nothing. Told you Joel would show me up. I knew it. I knew it. I'm telling you, don't bring anybody fishing if you want to catch stuff. What? You caught more? Dang, you did get them. What the heck? Maybe some of you been shooting a shotgun out here. Yeah. That would be kind of crazy because uh, I don't know how you could get a shotgun out here without somebody complaining. I mean, it is California after all. Zilch. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now we're feeling stuff. Uh-oh, Joel's pulling it up. Nothing? Oh, boy. Ha, ah, finally, I got a twist tie. Ooh, and a little tiny hook. Gosh, can you guys even see that? That thing is tiny. To the pile. Pile of stuff. structure down there I keep hitting it Ooh. still grabbing the bottom man that took a while to bring in that was a long shot there oh yes I got a jig sweet nice Hook is still good. Everything is still good. That ain't even that old. Sweet. Check it out. Nice colors. It's got different color eyes too. That one's uh, yellow. That one's like a reddish brown. Sweet. I'm going to use that. I just stepped on my own line again. I'm a professional line stepper. And not the good kind. Definitely not the good kind. What you got? That is one clean magnet. Oh, doubles on I randomness. I don't know what that is. It is a, what the heck, oh, that's a blade for like a, whoa, now it looks like I caught it. <laughs> I'm not cheating, I promise, I won't edit it out. Yeah, it looks like a willow, ble willow blade or something for a spinnerbait. I'm bringing the trash can over, we're getting, we're getting it, we're getting some stuff today. And I got a hook, a really nasty old hook that ain't going to work no more. There we go. I got about 48 feet of line out that time. So, oh, this should be pretty good. I 
what do you guys think we're going to get? Because I know there's stuff out there. Man, some more of those BB looking things to the can. Oh yeah, I know some of you know where I am right now. And there used to be a restaurant right there. And there used to be a deck that came out from where the concrete is now. And that was a pretty long time ago, but it wasn't so long ago that couldn't not find a nice Rolex or something. Never know. Maybe a gold chain necklace attached to something that's magnetic. I don't know. This feels really strange right now. What the heck is that? I got a bunch of leaves. And a whole lot of nothing. Uh oh, Joel's coming in. Taking the spot. He knows he's gonna get it. I think that's why. He just knows what's up. Look at Joel, he is so concentrated. He knows he's gonna get some. He knows he's going to beat me at it, too. Joel, Joel we, uh, are we getting the biggest thing today, or are we getting the most? What's the goal? I think he's saying the biggest. Oh, I caught the thing that fell in the water. No, did you guys see that? I know exactly what it was. It was a fat Ica. And no, I'm not being rude. And yes, that is a willow, a giant willow leaf, willow blade to a spinner bait. And a bunch of junk. Back to the depths, magnet. Find me money. Well, I know money is not magnetic, but it could be in a safe that is magnetic, or it could be in something else that's magnetic, like a, a purse or something of some sort. We don't want your fish, we want your trash. What'd you get? Nothing? Nothing? Just a clean magnet? Hey, I got me a hook, a real old hook, and more of that shot stuff. Oh, lovely. Wow, tandem shot right there. Let's see who brings up what. What do you think you're going to get, Joel? Wow, he said probably nothing. What do you think I'm going to get? He's a very positive person. He said, I'm going to probably catch something this time. He said, realistic. I say positive. Yes, I got a broken hook covered in who knows what. And... Joel got another hook. And what else was there? Oh yeah, he got a little shot. More of that whatever steel shot there is out there for no apparent reason. Boom! It is always so much fun to hear that magnet hit the water. It is pretty non-stop action, but we want some big stuff today. Or tonight. Because it's almost no light. Okie doke, folks. We are going to move on from this spot because obviously... Yeah, you already know. 
you already know. And if you magnet fish, say so below. And what you do, ow, when you get hooked by a hook, oh, people, get your freaking tetanus shots before you go do this. Get them anyway, because, I don't know, you will get stabbed by metal, it's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time before that happens. Here we go, everybody, we're coming up on it, our next spot. Nice and lit up for all you guys that are watching. Can't control the sun. If I could, I probably would not need to do any magnet fishing. Oh, oh I thought it felt heavier. Check it out, what we get? Oh, nice, we got a knife. Sweet. That was the knife nut cast. See that? Knife. Oh, oh, it broke when it hit the magnet. Dang it. Ah, oh, whatever. We got another one in the last video anyway, so I got one to make all nice for you guys. Oh, wow. That nut was stuck. Don't get your nut stuck. I'm telling you. Ooh. Oh, thank you, sir. Check it out. Oh, dude, that's freaking heavy. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh my goodness. <sighs> Holy cow. Huh? Check that out. That is like freaking crazy. Ugh. I wonder if I can get it off. <sighs> You know what? Watch this. Oh, there we go. Don't do that. Don't do that like I just did. Woo! You break your toes if you don't got like steel toe boots or something. But we got it. Check out that ugly thing. Oh my gosh. Finally. That thing is crazy. I mean, I know why somebody put it down there. <laughs> that is like a fish home and a half right there. Check that out. That is just like a motel for a fish. And a couple of them, too. Sorry, catfish. I took your home. Uh, now I'm going to go get your other one. That wasn't even it. That was something else. There we go. Hooked onto it again. It's coming up coming up oh it's so freaking heavy holy cow oh my gosh here it comes guys hey you got that light on you oh my gosh it's right there at the surface oh it's freaking huge it's another one it's a bigger one oh my gosh oh i'm gonna have to take this out just to get my magnet back oh Oh, I told you I was going back to the hotel. I caught the motel. Oh my gosh. Woo. Dang. Am I ever going to get this magnet back? Holy cow. I can't even move it. I'm going to get my line from underneath it though. My rope. So it don't get broke. Okay. Wow. Okay. Oh my gosh, guys. This is ridiculous. Ugh. Okay, we're just gonna have to lay down the hotel here, fish hotel, and get our magnet back. <clears throat> okay, I have no idea if I'm gonna be able to do this. <laughs> oh my gosh, man! Sometimes you just hook something big, and it still don't give up once you finally catch it. 
very nice. It's a nice day, it's a nice night, it's a nice everything. It's just nice. The catches are big. I can't complain. Not one bit. Oh boy. What do you know? We came back. Came back with a vengeance. And yes, I know, this is Joel's first time, so. And I didn't even teach him nothing, and he was still beating me for the first half of the day. Can you believe it? Oh, man. We nailed it. Uh, yes, pun intended. Telling you. Check it out. Oh, sheesh. Oh, my gosh. No. Oh. Holy cow. How do I even hold this thing? Oh, jeez, Dang, dude. Oh. Oh, it's like a quarter inch steel at least. Oh. You guys got any tips on how to remove these magnets? I'm all ears. So stuck, I don't even know how to get it off. I'm telling you, man, a clean stick is hard to find. But somehow I found it. Oh, gosh. Oh, I'll bring you guys back when I figure this out. Here we go. This is the contraption I figured out that this likes to get stuck underneath the bench and I'm just gonna try to rip it off going that way so, here goes nothing oh it moved it moved oh we got it we got it back oh yeah magnet fishing madness folks I'm telling you hey and I got a smashed bottle cap that's how look how flat that thing is that I'm telling you, it was stuck on there. And there's your evidence, a super flat cap. Oh man. Thanks for hanging in there with us on this long journey today. It wasn't that long, it was only about an hour. Uh, but man, we caught them. I mean, check, check it out, check this stuff out. This is insane. Like, I almost couldn't get my magnet off. It's so freaking heavy. And not only that, I mean, look, look at that. Next to my finger, that's, gosh, quarter inch, quarter inch thick steel plate, like, dude, they're rated for 880, the one I'm using, pulling force on a clean surface, obviously, that's pretty disgusting, but, man, good luck, I hope y'all don't get stuck like me, till next time, I'm Magnet Fishing Madness, go catch yourself, your own. Fish Hotel.